For denture care, we would need the resident's dentures and a denture brush. I have already sanitized my hands and put gloves on and I got the dentures from the patient. And we would put those in a denture cup. Dentures are very expensive, so we don't want to walk across the floor with them. And if they drop on the floor, they can crack and they're very expensive to repair and they take a fair amount of time, which means that person doesn't have their teeth to eat and to speak clearly. So um, I would bring the denture cup and the denture brush over to the sink. I'm gonna put down some barriers so that I have a place to put that and it's not just on the countertop that may have some pathogens on it. I also need to put a barrier in the sink, which would just be a washcloth. So again, if I drop the dentures, they're gonna land on the washcloth and hopefully not get damaged. So I'm gonna take the water. The denture brush has a long side and a short side. So the long side goes in the grooves of the dentures and the short side is used for the teeth. So I'm just gonna get both of those under the water. I'm gonna use the long part in the grooves of the dentures and then the short side in the teeth. Okay, I'm gonna rinse those and set that on my clean barrier. This is the lower denture because it fits around the tongue. So I'm gonna take the long part of the brush again and go in that groove that would go around the resident's gums. And then take the shorter bristles and clean the teeth. Okay, I wanna make sure I rinse that thoroughly and rinse the denture brush. And then I wanna make sure I rinse out the cup and the lid. And then if I were going to give the dentures back to the resident, I'm gonna put them in the cup. It's easier to put the dentures in if they are still a little bit wet. Um, if they're gonna store overnight, I need to fill that cup up with water and make sure that the dentures are covered. And then if the resident prefers, we can put a denture tablet in there to clean. And then if I were getting those out in the morning, I would scrub again to get um, the cleanser off of the denture. And then we would put the lid on to store overnight. And then I would remove my gloves. Sanitize my hands. And then I would return the dentures to wherever they're stored and the denture brush typically goes in the emesis basin in the nightstand. And then I would make sure the resident is comfortable, has their call light, bed is lowered and locked, and open up the door and then report anything if there's any issues with the oral care to the nurse.